Chris Sullivan there in a big game in Brazil this Friday. Northview Knights felt like they let one slip away on senior round against Edgewood earlier this week. Tonight, Clay City comes to call in. They have won three straight and hoping to leave Northview with a big old county win. Let's take you there. Eels haven't beaten the Knights since 2020. Third quarter, Clay City with the lead. Kyle Cotti, though, finds Braden Golf for the basket plus the foul. That cuts it to a 10-point game. Eels are not going anywhere, though. They push this one up ahead to Zach Swearingen. Had a monster second quarter. Gets the hoop and harm here. He is pumped. Clay City's lead back up to double digits. Knights still fighting. They throw it inside to Drew Cook. No good. Kyle Cotty is there for the putback. Knights down by 12 in the third. Here comes Drew Cook, though, in transition. Going to the hoop for two. Plus the foul. Northview cuts it to single late in the third. Fourth quarter action. Clay City leading by eight. And some good passing over and back to Riley Myers. Open at the top of the key for three. Yeah, he makes that one. Eels back up 11. Then Myers kicks it ahead to Swearingen for another triple. Back-to-back -back Clay City threes. Purple power. Clay City leads by 14. Northview down by single digits. Looking for an answer. This shot is no good here. Bryce Wyram grabs the rebound and pushes it up ahead to Ethan Edwards for the basket. Plus the foul. Finally, they break Northview's press here. Northview trying to keep it close late. With two more for Myers on the basket. Then watch as we stay with this play. Myers is going to send this one in. Gets the steal here, though, as we stick with the play. Drew Cook coming back down the court. Here's the steal by Myers. He's going to push it up ahead to Zane Keller, who lays this one in. And this summed up the night for Clay City and Northview. Clay City gets the big win over Northview. Just the second time ever they've ever won in Brazil. 76-67, to the final.